it's really been spent on evaluation, you know, and, and last year at this time we were so busy trying to uh, hire our staff and put everything together um, that we really hadn't had an opportunity to um, evaluate and dig into our own team uh, or get ahead on the, the next waves of uh, acquisition uh, phases of the, of the off season with the draft, uh, the combine, free agency, and so we were really behind. And so uh, this, this spring has been different. Um, very little turnover on our staff, and so we've already evaluated our entire team, our entire roster. We've already gotten much further ahead in terms of free agency and the players that we're gonna see here in Indy, um, which I can honestly say we were not in that position last year. So I uh, feel good about the direction we're headed in, know a lot more now about our team, uh, what we need to do, and I'm just excited about this process. You don't, you know, generally want to be picking there, but, you know, uh, sometimes it becomes a catalyst for things that you're going to accomplish, you know, moving forward. And so, uh, being the position we're in, um, we will have an opportunity to add a really good football player. Um, regardless of the position side of the ball, um, we're hoping to do our, our work here over the next so many weeks and then nail that, that opportunity uh, and really add a good solid football player. Most importantly, a guy who's tough, smart, explosive, um, and really gonna help the Raiders as we, as we move forward. Well, uh, you know, the quarterback is, is usually the leader of your football team, so you're gonna have to be able to lead. Um, you know, you win in this game by passing the football offensively. And so, you know, you'd like a guy to be able to be really proficient in terms of his ability to throw the ball accurately and get it to the guys that, that you have to get it to. Um, he's gonna have to handle adversity, uh, so toughness is gonna be a prerequisite. Uh, very difficult to go through the National Football League season and not deal with some things, whether they be physically, uh, mentally, emotionally, um, you know, there's going to be swings during the course of the season that the quarterback has to handle and we know he gets the credit when we win. We also know he gets the blame when we lose and so being able to be mentally tough, physically tough is really important for us. Um, and he's going to have to be able to grow, um, you know, and show the aptitude that he can learn, think, uh, and continue to improve because no matter who it is, veteran, young player, um, this position is ever evolving and you're gonna to need to be able to acclimate into a new system, into a new place with new teammates, new coaches, um, you know, and hopefully become the best version of yourself. But um, this position is near and dear to my heart. Um, I know it's an important position, obviously, to every team in the National Football League, and um, I'm super excited to get this thing started. We see the league, and the league is very diverse in terms of you know, you have the guys that are pocket passers. We have some of the guys that can do some things with their legs. We have some guys that are kind of combo guys. Um, we've seen the, the height requirement of the quarterback position change over the last so many years with some of the really good players that are a little shorter. Um, you know, so uh, I think there's, you know, uh, there's opportunity for every type of player at that position. And so um, the exciting thing for us is we're evaluating them all. Um, you have to be able to kind of fit them all in somehow, some way, and have a plan for them, depending on what their skill set is and what their strengths are. Um, and so it's a, it's, a, it's a long process. And again, part of that process is what you're going to do with them if you acquire them. Our whole football team, um, you know, can, can improve. Uh, I think our players would be the first people to tell you that, you know. So, I think there's an element of us trying to work with the guys when they come back here in April um, of really developing the players that are on our roster and then adding competition at every spot and the defense certainly, um, you know, we have some areas that we know we can address, uh, we need to address and, and we're going to try to do that um, with as many young players as we can.